Hi, this is Nicholas York, a registered migration and education agent from Pathway to Oz. At Pathway to Oz, we help you plan and execute your pathway to permanent residency. Uh, guys, today I'm going to discuss something that was you know, semi-recently announced, which is the 482 Pathway to PR for visa holders of the short-term stream. Um, so basically, it was announced earlier this year and it came into effect from the 1st of July. Um, immigration recently announced a new pathway for those in Australia on a 482 visa through the short term stream. Now please note, this information is general in nature um, and you know, to review your specific circumstances, I'd always recommend chatting with a migration agent. Now look, the changes don't affect everybody, so not every single person can apply for the pathway to PR. Um, but basically what happened on the 1st of July, existing 482 visa holders in the short term stream um, may be able to apply for permanent residency through the 186 temporary resident transition stream. Okay, so it's still an employer sponsored visa. Now look, it's, it's only really beneficial or mainly beneficial to, to applicants on a 482 visa in Sydney, Melbourne and Brisbane maybe in some other regional areas as well. Um, and it's only really beneficial to those on the 482 visa in the short term occupation stream. Everyone else, I mean, if you're living in a regional area, you could probably apply for the 494, the skilled regional visa, which has a pathway to PR, or if your occupation's on the medium to long term stream, I mean, you could just apply for the 186 direct entry stream. To be eligible for the, um, the pathway, uh, applicants will still need to meet the, the 186 TRT stream requirements. Um, applicants will still will need to have been in Australia for a minimum of 12 months from the 1st of Feb 2020 to the 14th of December 2021. And this is the big one guys. Applicants must have worked in their occupation for at least three years full time immediately before lodging the 186. Please note the pathway will be accessible for only two years from the 1st of July to the 1st of July, 2024. Um, that's when sort of the, I guess the, the restrictions ease, but there is chat that immigration will look to extend this to additional visa holders. So, I mean, what's really sort of negative is if, is if, you, can't write, if you can't get those three years on the 482 visa in order to to apply for the PR or transition onto the 186 before the 1st of July, 2024. At the moment, there is no pathway for you, um, but we have been hearing sort of, you know, talk about immigration introducing something like that soon. So, I mean, guys, as well, additionally, if you are on a 482 short-term stream, you can look at the 190, the state nominated visa, that could be a pathway to PR. Um, but look, I hope you find this information helpful. Uh, the information is general in nature and if you'd like to discuss your circumstances in detail, please feel free to book in for a chat with a registered migration agent. Thank you.